We finish in the Middle East, where Kara tested the skills of two former sports stars during the Abu Dhabi HSBC Championship. Well, HSBC are well known to put on some good entertainment at their golf events, and I'm at one of them and have been joined by two of their ambassadors, Tim Henman and George Gregan. Boys, both, thank you very much for joining us. Both retired from your respective sports, tennis and rugby. Now pretty keen golfers, aren't you? We know you are for sure, Tim. Yeah, definitely. I think we um, both come into the category of, of golf addicts and, and uh, I'm lucky uh, enough to have been at this HSBC Golf Championships for the last few years and it's, uh, it's absolutely fantastic. You've obviously got the best players in the world um, on the course, but then you come to the village and, and uh, there's a lot of fun uh, off the course. So, uh, yeah, it's great to be back. And George, how much uh, do you find yourself on a golf course these days? Well, I've had a bit more time since I've retired about three years ago, but wouldn't like to have some more time on the course, but it's a fantastic game. It's something I grew up, sort of got the, the golf bug when I was about 11 or 12 and have been playing it ever since. And it's the thing I like about it, it just brings so many people from different walks of life together, sharing the great sport, which is golf. Well, we're going to put on a bit of challenge for these two today. We're going to test their passing accuracy here. 30 seconds, we'll see how many Tim does. Three, two, one, go. Oh, he's missed the first one. Don't say that. Oh, <laughs> second. Oh, he's, he's, in. he's got one in. First one out. Yeah. Bit of coaching tips awesome. going on here. Yeah, there was. Two's in. Yeah, he's working on yesterday. Three's in. Drive, mate. Four's in. They have had a bit of practice at this. I'll let you know. How are we doing for time? Five's in. Six in. Twenty seconds. Twenty seconds. Oh, seven. Stop. We'll give you that. It bounced out. Eight in. Nine. Come on, George. Come on, George. Ten. Is it a minute? All right, oh. Time over. Can we take that last one? Yeah. Definitely. Okay. 11. Yeah. 11. 11. Well done. <laughs> 11 to like beat. Minute. Wow. I'm yeah, pretty that, impressed. That was a generous, that was a generous, that was a generous 30, 30 seconds, seconds, I think. Are we ready on the clock? Yeah. Three, two, one. We're off. 30 seconds. He's missed the first one, too. And the second one. He's in now. He's on a roll. One's in. Oh. oh. One's in. Oh, he's, come on, George. Two's in. Oh. Three. Concentration here. Four. Four. Five. Six. How much time? Seven. Eight. Oh. Nine. Oh. I'll give you that. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the way it's supposed to happen, but. After the ashes, we need a bit of a boost against the we Aussies. We do need a bit of a boost. This explains itself. It's who can serve the fastest. Uh, we know who uh, we'd expect to serve the fastest, but let's wait and see. 94, 94. is his first <laughs> miles per hour. What okay. was your fastest back in the day, Tim? Uh, 141. 141, yes. okay. Yeah. okay. We've got to get over 100. Well, that came out a bit better, didn't it? 101. 101. <laughs> Can he beat that? Thank goodness. No pressure, George. You need to try and beat him. Field. So you've got to go a little bit stronger this way. That was that grip, wasn't it? Yeah, exactly. Good hit. 73. 73. Flatten it out. Yeah, Give it a flatten hit. it out. Attempt. Oh, that's a good hit. The shot 99! Oh, I found something there. I found something there. Go on, have another one. We've done the rugby, we've done the tennis. You both should be suitably warmed up. Should be yeah, totally. Yeah. Should we go and try the golf? <laughs> okay, boys, the golf challenge awaits us. How well do you know the old course, George First? I know it very well by watching it on TV. The road hole is just one of those iconic holes, isn't it? And you just don't want to be in that pot bunker. So here we are. I'm looking forward to actually physically trying to get out of one. Yeah, the iconic road hole bunker from the 17th hole at St Andrews. Tim, you've had a bit of experience in the real thing, right? <laughs> yeah, and that, I'm sure, I'm convinced, is a lot deeper. Cheapest, man. Look at that, it's out first time. It's not even hit the back of the wall, which I think is legal. George's turn, in you get, I'll throw you the balls. Look at that, beautiful. Oh, Bit oh of help from the God. HSBC sign. He may have lost the rugby challenge, he may have lost the tennis challenge, but he has won the challenge with a bit of help from an HSBC board. No, most definitely. Uh, that was that's what it all comes oh, thanks, down mate. to. It's good to get something on the board. One from three ain't bad. There you go. <laughs>